welcome back to life update with t thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me and if you are new to this channel please do subscribe and also like um well i also have to tell you that on this channel i don't really include clips whenever i post any big brother Mzansi, um, um videos because i already have strikes i already have strikes uh copyright strikes from dstv and i wouldn't want to jeopardize my channel uh going forward so i'm still like laying it low you know so yeah just please do understand so guys um you know what last night i was listening to um the conversation between sister mara uh terry and paul but before i talk about that that there's something that sister mara said that uh didn't really sit well with me sister mara mentioned that some of the housemates that left were under the closet um honestly i don't think it is a good thing to judge someone by how they look or how they do certain things or you know just stuff like that just because um, you found yourself and you're out of the closet doesn't necessarily mean that other people were under the closet. You know, it is not by force for people to be what you think of them or to be what you want them to be. You know, because um, one thing I realized in the past ever since Big Brother Mzansi began was that Sister Mara was always, always talking to okay maybe the likes of temba always explaining to to temba that also he never knew when growing up um that he was gonna be what he is right now but uh, at some point in his life he realized that okay um i realized that i like certain things like girl stuff and everything but because of the society he couldn't be open about who he was and he also mentioned that there are people who are exactly like that who are exactly like that but are afraid to come out of um to be out of the closet because of the society so listening to the conversation that or maybe to what he was saying yesterday made me think like okay why does he always have to push the narrative that people are not being true to themselves just because he chose or he is the way he is maybe he didn't choose but because he is the way he is not everybody is gonna be like him and it's not everybody who's who's like that you know so i really think he should really cool it down a bit when it comes to that topic because also it's a very sensitive topic to to talk about and people should just live the, their lives the way they want to but at the end of the day i do not feel like it's good for him to be projecting how he feels to other people you know so yeah um i don't know guys but i don't, <laughs> I don't know when terry is finally gonna learn that some things don't really have to be said or it's okay not to talk all the time you know um it's it's very much okay so yesterday um they were having a conversation where they spoke about a lot quite a number of things regarding nile um regarding her hygiene and everything you know and saying that she lied about a lot of things about working with brands about being a model and all of those things but right now my question is why didn't they tell her when they were why she, where, while she was still inside the house for example um they did discuss yoli's issue when they spoke about um yoli smelling and everything like that i made a video about that do check it out and obviously i didn't support that i didn't support that, that at all because it was women who were just ganging up and you know discussing that conversation i was not really comfortable with them talking about yoli like that and it's still i still share the same sentiments even right now as i'm recording this video i do not support um what they were saying about nale last night if they felt like she was the way 
they described why didn't they approach her or at least like try and make her aware you know of certain things and also why didn't they tell her in in her face or straight to her face when she was still inside the house that okay Nile we know that you're lying about everything that you're saying uh, about working with uh, big brands and everything we know that you're lying you're nothing like that i feel like it, it would have been better because how do they expect Nile to take all of that right now that she's outside of the house you know because obviously they know Nale is outside and she will definitely know what they are saying about her right now so i don't know guys maybe i'm just being too much um around this topic but i just feel like what they did was wrong even the first time when they spoke about Gioli it was not nice it was really not nice if you feel like someone is is doing something that you're not comfortable with or is being somehow like in a way that you don't understand you talk to them you understand you you discuss it with them you make them aware that you're not comfortable with certain things and you're not comfortable with the way they do things you know maybe just maybe they will change and and you know be make a comfortable space for you you know so um as far as i know actually nale has been working with brands i also didn't know until now that she's out of the house and i saw um i i, I like i saw how she's been trending the past few days and whenever i go to twitter and i check out all the, the the threads and everything i'd see like a lot of alphas had included like um brands had tagged brands that she, she has worked with had also posted pictures of uh, the campaigns that she's done before and i can tell you guys this girl has done so good for herself honestly she's done amazing and also i really still think she's she's one humble being you know because during the time in a house i even for a second guys even for a minute i never heard her bragging about anything about who which branches worked with and everything i never heard that i never heard that i don't want to lie all out here is that she's she's a model and she travel a lot you know and stuff like that but yeah guys at the end of the day uh, i really feel like terry and 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 mpo and temba should learn not temba sorry sister mara should learn should learn how to approach situations differently rather than gossiping i feel like it's it's good to approach someone and say it straight to their face with your full chest i feel like it's so much better Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I will see you again on my next video. I love you so much. Bye.